The United States patent system began in 1790, based on principles set forth in the U.S. Constitution, which granted Congress the power to promote the progress of science and useful arts by securing for limited times to authors and inventors the exclusive right to their respective writings and discoveries. Since then, our system of patent application, examination, and issuance has helped produce countless great inventions, from the light bulb to the airplane. Before a patent can be issued, a structured patent application must be filed with the Patent and Trademark Office. The patent application contains both a description of the invention, designed to enable others to recreate the invention, and a list of specific legal claims identifying in detail exactly what aspect of the invention will be owned by the patent holder if the patent is granted. Although the written description, which lawyers call the patent specification, is very helpful in understanding what an invention does and how it operates, the legal claims are the real heart of any patent. This is because the patent gives the inventor the right to exclude others from making or using only that which is specifically covered by one of the patent's claims. Before an application can become an issued patent, the patent examiner compares it to the inventions, discoveries, and writings that came before. This is called prior art, and it is crucial because it forms the basis for the examiner's decisions about which claims to accept, and which to reject. Without prior art, an examiner has no way of telling whether the patent application represents an invention that's new, useful, and non-obvious. Furthermore, patent examiners cannot be specialists in every type of technology, which is why they need our help, now more than ever, to discover all the technical or sometimes just hard to find prior art that's out there. Your expertise and assistance is vitally important to helping an examiner find prior art, or even to know where to begin looking. There are three things to keep in mind when searching for prior art. First, prior art should be published. Books, journal articles, and other patents are great places to start, but you can also find prior art in sources like magazine articles. Existing products can also be useful prior art. Even code samples can be relevant to your search. Second, prior art must come before the date of the invention. It may not be clear from the patent application when the invention took place, but at the least, you don't need to worry about things that were published after the application was filed. Third, prior art must relate to a particular claim in the patent application. Focusing on a specific claim will help you narrow the scope of your search for relevant prior art, and your results will be much more useful to a patent examiner. By assisting the patent examiner with a thorough and informed prior art search, we can help make sure that patents are only granted for truly new inventions. You can help promote the progress of science and the useful arts. Share your expertise and pitch in at Pier 2 Patent.